promotional consideration paid for by the following. Hello and welcome to another Quick Shot Review. I am your host Luke and you are the Cheap Shot Nation. Today we're going to look at a Irish horror movie, horror comedy more is the description of this one. It is Stitches from 2012, directed by Conor McMahon and play and starring Ross Noble, the very well-known comedian um, who is absolutely fabulous in this movie and his deadpan style works really well with this film. So maybe you've seen this film, maybe you haven't. If you have, leave us a comment down below. Let us know what you thought of this film. This classic film from 2012. If you haven't seen this film, find out what my thoughts are on this one in the main part of the video. I'll see you there. Stitches from 2012, directed by Conor McMahon, starring Ross Noble as the clown known as Stitches, uh, is a about a clown that comes back from the dead to haunt the children, the now teenagers, that caused his fatal demise at a kid's birthday party due to a, a mishap. He was hired as the clown and, uh, yes, ended up. Uh, not of this world, shall we say. Um, so it also stars Tommy Knight playing Tom, uh, Egan McQuinn playing Richie, Gemma Leah DeVoe playing Kate, Shane Murray Cochran playing Vinnie, uh, Thomas Kane Byrne playing Bulger, Rosin Barron playing Sarah, Hugh Mulhern playing Paul, Tommy Cullen playing Dan, Lorna Dempsey playing Mary and Gemma Curran playing Jenny. That is pretty much the rundown of the whole cast of this one. Uh, and like I said, just finished watching this one and it was full of true laugh out loud moments and it still makes me laugh now. I first watched this probably back in 2012 um, because it was available and it was really really good and it still holds up today um it is a fabulous movie absolutely brilliant absolutely brilliant and there's some nice real horror touches here classic horror nods to classic horror gory practical effects but the effects are very well done and very imaginative Bearing in mind that the killer is a clown, we're not talking Pennywise the clown, but we're talking a clown that is actually, you know, hired for kids' birthday parties. Um, and, uh, yeah, it's just a really nice film with lots of throwbacks to horror, uh, uh, classic horror as well. So uh, if you like entertaining films uh comedy and horror that has done well and um you know uh ross noble of course then you will absolutely adore this film um i love practical horror effects and that's been said many many times this film does that really really well and uh you know there's some outstanding moments in this film in this film that really do like I say they do stand out and the clown uh, stitches tends to kill the main characters based on what they are known for the most um for example one eats a lot of horror cliches and uh one is the joker so he gets 
is his comeuppance based on that and the one that eats a lot gets his comeuppance based on that there's a nice little touch with uh, an umbrella kill which i'm not gonna i'm not gonna spoil for you but it's probably the one of the funniest moments in this film the script is really good as well and well thought out um and like i say lots of cliches here obviously the main part of the film is where the kills happen and that's done at a team party uh, again something that you'd absolutely expect from a film of this caliber um and it reminds me a lot of the reanimator um so if you like really funny films that have also got touches of horror then this is one for you and uh yeah, I've watched this film many, many times and it never fails to make me laugh. So would I recommend this film? Absolutely, yes. If you're a fan of horror, if you're a fan of comedy, even if you're not a fan of horror, this one will have you wincing. It will have you laughing out loud, belly laughs, um, the, the, the best uh, script that I've seen from a horror movie for quite a while especially a comedy horror as well which is not done too much these days i will mention here that studio 666 is probably the the one that's made me laugh out loud the most in recent years which we will do a review of as well and uh, yeah recommended film on your watch list definitely put this on there and uh, yeah i'm gonna say with this one give it a go if you can find it uh, i think it's on um amazon prime so it is available for you to watch if you've got the subscriptions and it you will not regret it it is one of those films you look at the look at the picture and you think eh, maybe you're a fan of like cheesy horror but this one is cheesy horror but it's done really well and it does have some genuinely sort of frightening moments that are very offset with the comedy as well and it is a fabulous film don't know how many times i can say that but i'm going to say it again a fabulous film with that if you've seen this movie like i've already said in the opener leave us a comment down below leave us a comment subscribe like the video and don't forget to join us on social media, Instagram, Twitter, and Facebook. I will set up a new t-shirt shop very, very soon as well, once I've got some time, uh, because um, close to water, close my shop down. Don't think they're doing that kind of thing anymore. So uh, we're looking at other avenues for that. But this film is hilarious, and I hope you check it out. Until then, movie fans, I will see you in the next video. Movies, movie videos, film reviews coming out every Tuesday on Quick Shot Reviews without fail. Maybe some downtime in between, but usually without fail. With that, thank you very much for watching, and I will see you next time. Goodbye. Yeah.